Happy Halloween everyone and hopefully we've got some spectacular deals for you today and as always we're going to be covering every game that can be completed in under two hours whilst also having a quick look at any games that are on sale that are worth mentioning. So let's waste no more time, let's roll those credits and get into this video. So as you can see there is not much on sale this week. The main sale is the Fallout Day sale. So you've got Fallout 4 there and Fallout 3. Both games are actually just available in Game Pass but a great opportunity if you don't. £2.09 there and $3.93. You've also got the Fallout 4 Game of the Year edition and we've also got Fallout New Vegas there. All really cheap if you don't have Game Pass, a great opportunity to pick these up but you are looking at about 80 hour completion so not the quickest. And that's pretty much it as it comes to sales. The Shocktober sale will be over by the time this video airs. And so will the Xbox sale. So the only other one is the Xbox Game Pass Core sale. And it's pretty slim pickings in here too. You've got LA Noir there. This one's $17.49, still pretty cheap. 4.5 rated, a 40 to 50 hour completion that one. You've got Trials Fusion here again, a 40 to 50 hour. Nice and cheap though. Midnight Suns we've mentioned that one a few times that again is a 60 to 80 hour completion you've got Rayman Legends I remember playing that one but that again is an 80 hour you've got a few other games here we're gonna be mentioning a few of these later on the Outbreak games are always on our list those have some really quick completions you've got three of those ones there and you've got Woodley 2 there now don't get this one confused with its first game the first one can be completed in one to two hours this second one will take you about 20 20 to 25 hours so don't get confused by that nice cheap price tag this one is definitely not going to be on the quick completion list and that's about it so without further ado let's just go jump straight into all those games that can be completed in under two hours so here we go as always with every game that can be completed in under half an hour first and the first one is another bargain from East Asia Soft. I'm loving this strategy of being able to pick up both the Xbox and console version for one game in a single transaction. It's such a brilliant idea and is great for us achievement hunters. And the next game that East Asia Soft has done this with is Swap Shop. You will get both the console and the Windows version for one cheap payment of £3.35. This game has only just been released so this is its introductory rate so it will only be on for a limited time. So this is a great opportunity to jump into this puzzle 2D adventure game right from the off. You've also got at 50% off Discolored. This one's £4.19 rated 2.75. This is a strange and surreal puzzle adventure game. A game from Desert Water Games that has had two updates or already making this one worth 3000 G and that's Bellatron. This one's currently 30% off at 293, a real bargain there. That's less than a pound for every 1000 G. And this is classed as a logic arcade puzzle game. After Wave Down 4 next, this one's 60% off at 499, rated 2.75 and this is a arcade shooter. Big Chick, £3.14, 25% off. This one's rated 2.5 and is an adventure game on a sinking island and this action game has seen one update so you'd actually be able to pick up 2000 G for this game and the final one in this category is perfect ninja painter now this one has had one update so it's worth 2000 G it's currently 10% off at 377 rated 2.5 and also available it's its Windows 10 version which is also 377 10% off and this can net you another 2000G making this combo worth 4000G. So let's move swiftly on to all those games that can be completed in one hour but more than half an hour and then unfortunately there is only three to talk about this week. The first one is based on an old TV license that I remember from when I was a kid and it's one of the TV series I remember most fondly and that's Inspector Gadget. Now this isn't based on the Inspector Gadget 
I remember as a kid, but more on the more modern take of it, and the game's called Inspector Gadget Mad Time Party. Now this game did only come out on September the 14th, but is already rated 3.75, and is currently 15% off at 28.46. So this is a seriously good game based on that OTV license. Another game that's scoring pretty well is Repentant. This one's rated 2.75, 20% off at 6.71. And this is a dramatic point and click adventure game with hand painted art. And the final game is a game that's appeared on this list a few times and that's Garfield's Lasagna Party, 50% off at 16.74, rated 2.75 and this is a party style game. Now you might have only had three games to pick from in this category but these are three seriously well rated games so it's definitely something to be considering this week. And as always we finish with all those games that take you one to two hours to complete and our first one is Unheard Voices of Crime Edition. I'm sure this one was on here not too long ago. It's rated 2.25, 40% off at 5.24 and this is an adventure game. Eden Gate, The Edge of Life, 382, 35% off, rated 3.25, so a reasonably good game this one. This one is classed as an action adventure. Kingdom of Aurelia, Mystery of the Poison Dagger, 20% off, 1339. There's quite a few expensive games in the list this week. Rated 2.5 is an adventure point and click with some head scratching puzzles, apparently. Marquette, next. This one is in Game Pass, but if you don't, this one's currently 60% off, 6.69. I have started this game. It's definitely worth getting if you haven't got Game Pass. It has some really cool puzzles that will definitely get you thinking. X-Force Genesis, now this is the PC or Windows version, 20% off at 3.43. Again, only just been released this one, October the 26th this one came out, is worth 1000 G there. Murder is Game Over, 20%, 3.99 this one. Another new release this one, only released on the 27th of October this one. So a couple of new games there, this one's an Adventure point and click. Beat Souls 60% off 335 rated 3 stars so a decent rhythm game here. And we had a couple of these last week and the second entry in the series is here. Murder Diaries 2 40% off £5.03 almost looks like they forgot to add it to the sale last week. And this one is rated 2.25. Antarctica 88 40% 299 Our first stinker of the week actually this one only rated 1.7 a first person shooter set in Antarctica, if you could have guessed. Quiplesh next, 50%, 3.99, rated 3.25, and this is a 3 to 8 player party game. Abzu, this one seems to be on the list every week at the minute, 65% off, 5.59, really cheap, really quick completion, and actually rated 3.5, and a good game just to top it off. Maze next. 399 which is 75% off its normal value which is 1599 so this is an absolute steal this week rated 2.75 and this is a first person adventure game the path of motus next 80% 249 rated 2.25 a puzzle platformer this one another game that has previously been in game pass this one's 70% off currently a real steal again at 322 and that's donut count now this is a real quick completion this one real simple puzzle game now what is probably going to be the worst game rated only one star literally one star and I've had on good authority that this is one of the worst game that some people have ever played and that's Alison's Diary Rebirth 40% off it's still going to set you back £5 and 3p and a rated one star this might be the one you want a stick away from this week and our final one is a licensed game and that Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. I'm pretty sure this one was given away at one point with games with gold, but if you missed that opportunity, it's currently 50% off, 624, rated 3.25, so not bad for a Star Wars or a licensed game, and especially one based on Episode 1. 
And if you might have not guessed, this is a pod style racing game. Well, that was it I'm afraid. That is everything that can be completed in under two hours. Bit of a slim pickings this week. There isn't really anything to be shouting about. There wasn't any real big bundles in here. There wasn't any real major huge gamer scores in there. And there wasn't even anything in the major sales that you would say are great AAA games worth picking up this week. So all in all, this might be a bit of a damp squid this week. It might be one where you sit out and wait for something else to come down the line. But if you're looking for a cheap alternative, maybe look at a couple of these games. We got Adverse. That one's only 99p. Will take you three to four hours. You got Monopoly Deal, £1.19. That will take you two to three hours to get the completion. You got Pillar by Michael Hicks and Gonzalo Antinas. That's a puzzle game that takes two to three hours. Or you've got Comic Top Secret, which is 159, 80% off, and that's an adventure game. So those are four other alternatives to have a look at this week, because to be fair, there really wasn't much in this sale. But if you're finding this information helpful, then please do like, share, and subscribe. Why not check out some of our guides as well? We have a lot of quick completion guides for a lot of the games that you're gonna see in our sale videos. So nip over to our channel and have a look at them it might even inspire you to your next game that you want to play and don't forget to hit the bell notification because that lets you know when we drop all our videos including these sales ones as sales are only on for a limited time and this sale is only going to be on to the 6th of november so make sure you pick up these deals now unlike me who always ends up seeming to miss the best deals well that's all i've got for you this week thanks all for watching and i'll see you all in the next video